Hello and welcome. Today I want to show you five of my favorite grooves for the handpan, which originate on other instruments. Let's get started. Let's start with a backbeat style groove, which we borrow from the drum set, or in this case the cajon. This is technically a whole family of grooves, and they are defined by the backbeat, the high accent on the second and fourth beat. They work in many different tempi, from slow to fast, and you have lots of different options for the placement of the low accents. Let's check out an example. For all the patterns, I will first play the basic groove and then a little musical sequence to give an example what you can do with it on the handpan. Let's add some melodies and turn this into a piece of music. The Khaliji is an incredibly useful rhythm. The name comes from the Middle East, but you find the same accent pattern in dubstep and other electronic music genres. It just works beautifully in many different styles of music. I stumbled upon this pattern when I was accompanying a flamenco guitar player on the cajon. I started using it for technique exercises in my online courses, because it's such a good exercise for hand-to-hand -hand playing, placement of accents and ghost notes. But it also works really well as a base for musical compositions. The accents in this pattern switch between right and left hand, and between them there are always two ghost notes, which are quite important to the flow of this pattern.
Since I need a name for this pattern, I'm calling it a halftime Khaliji. But what it actually comes down to is two bass strokes, on the first beat and on the two end. You can throw in the high accent on the four for good measure, but you can also leave that one out to create a lot of space. This one works great as a base for slow improvisations. This last pattern is like a double time version of the backbeat groove. It's used in drum and bass and other electronic music genres and it works great on the handpan, especially once you start muting some of the bass strokes. Alright, these were some of my favorite grooves to use on the handpan. Let me know your favorites in the comments. And if you want to get notified of future videos, subscribe to my channel and hit the little bell. Have a good practice and see you next week.